The arrest of those USD players on rape charges has created an environment on campus where students are now openly talking about sexual assault. But a group of law students says that conversation that's happening right now isn't focused on what it should be. They want the school to take more of a lead in guiding the discussion. For law student Paige Peterson, the last few days on the USD campus have been eye-opening. I understand that it's a sensitive topic and that a lot of people don't want to talk about sexual assault and they don't want to talk about rape. According to statistics from the Rape, Abuse and Incest National Network, 23% of female undergrads will be sexually assaulted during their college career. Peterson says in light of those numbers, there should be an emphasis at USD on making sure students know what resources are available to them should they be the victim of a sexual assault. But Peterson says there isn't one. If you find yourself in this situation, if you find a friend of yours in this situation, this is how you go about it and this is how you address it. So Peterson and other USD law students are in the midst of drawing up a letter asking USD administration for more transparency in how it deals with student sexual assault. The impact this case is having on campus is highlighted by articles in the campus newspaper, The Volant. One article in particular has this group of law students upset. But I was particularly troubled by Tina Harrelton's comments at the very end talking about the impact this is going to have on people. In that article, USD spokesperson Tina Harrelson commented on how the rape allegations hurt the image of the school and the football team. It was very disheartening to me that there was no, there was no um, sound bite or quote about the impact that it's made on victims. Obviously, the victim is the number one person in all of this. Harrelson sat down with us for an interview and tells us the school tries to be sensitive to the victim in a situation like this one by not talking about them at length. So we're just very cautious as a university that we don't um, say something or inadvertently reveal something that's going to reveal who the victim is. Now, we did learn late this afternoon that USD has now scheduled what it is calling an open forum to talk about sexual assault. We're told that it will be held coming up on November 13th.